What's going on, Roy? This is Daniel from Josh and Danny SEO. So uh, in my search, because uh, I'm trying to find your website over here, uh, J. L. Lopez Painting, Dallas, Texas, right? So I'm trying to be very accurate. The only thing I found for J. Lopez Painting, because this is uh, the other website, the other number I found listed on your website, which came out to be this uh, for J. L. Lopez Painting dot com. Unfortunately, nothing really pops up for it uh, because it's not working anymore. Now, if I do put you guys into a system over here, jlopezpainting.com. Now, again, I found the website a while, uh, probably about four or five months, uh, maybe about two months ago. So it could be that you don't have one anymore. It could be that you uh, decided this isn't the way you want to go with it. Um, but with your partner's number, because the number I called uh, for, you, for you, Roy, was different uh, because there were two numbers listed. This one and uh, the one I called you on, you don't have a website or anything. Um, now, you guys are listed on like Angie's List, uh, stuff like that, or uh, even next door. I believe that's the number that I did call you on. Um, and this is the partner's number. Yeah, so as you can see, it's just a little all over the place here. No website in sight, so I can't really give you an idea of what's going on. So let me show you what happens when you do have a website. So <clears throat> I'm going to use something we call keywords. Now, a keyword is what I would type into Google to find any, anybody or anything I am looking for, right? So if I need a job done for me, like painting, I'm going to be as specific as possible. So I'm going to put in Painters Dallas. That lets Google know I'm looking for a painter in Dallas, uh, in the Dallas area, but it lets you know that this person is looking for, is local to you. So this accomplishes a few things. It lets, uh, it's location specific and service specific, which is how we create Google ads like this. So Big Isles Painting is not only running a lot of Google Ads, they're also on top of the board for everything. But you have ADT Painting, all this stuff, next door Painting. And then we have your GMB, GBP. So it's um, basically very important to be in here. Google My Business Profile, 30, 40% of all people searching for painters or for anything will click on one of these three websites. So it's very important there. Um, and yes, you have one. Like I said, if I put in your specific name over here, it will pop up. But if I put painters, you will not pop up. You don't have enough going on over here for you guys to be anywhere on that list. But once we get past that, we have our um, organic search, right? Anyone can rank here as long as you have a website and you know what you're doing. So number one is Yelp. Number two is Big Al's Painting. Now, I don't like Big Al's Painting because they do a decent job. They're top lists and they're all right. So let's see what they're doing, right? They have their home about, the drop down menu over here. Now they could get a little bit more into it, but they don't. Showcase testimonials, contact, and then they have their phone number, which is a click to call. Always wanted as a click to call button. People are lazy. House Painters, Dallas, Texas. That alone is a keyword right there that they would rank for. They have residential, commercial, interior, exterior, everything that they said they have in that drop down menu. Get your free estimates. As you can see, they have content on their page, which is exactly what you want. By the way, these are, again, they are keywords that they are going to rank for as well as something like this it's an association game somebody types in something like that they'll pop up for that now that's not enough you can't just go through this with keywords you got to be um let's just say you have to have your website connected with other places um and i'm going to explain that in a minute but as you can see there's content on their page they're talking about what it is they're offering and they're doing a pretty good job. So let me show you what it is on the back end, right? I'm using a tool right here called Ahrefs. It kind of gives me an idea of how Google is looking at them. So right off the bat, a UR rating is how strong their website is, and a DR rating is how much Google trusts them. Now, they're not doing great in the DR rating, but they're still number one in the area, so they gotta be do, doing something correct. So here we got 537 backlinks. Now, backlink is where you have your website link, in this case, BigHousePainting.com, somewhere else where somebody can click on it, and a referring domain, which they have 102 of them, is when it comes back to your actual website. Now, not all are created equal. Like I said, you don't want BuzzFeed and Wikipedia ones. You want strong blogs from like painters, stuff like that, things that make sense. Now, they also have 383 organic keywords, stuff that people are searching for that they can be associated with. And they're bringing in almost 1,000 people a month to their website because of that. So, for example, Dallas House Painters. 500 people a month searched for this specific keyword. They're pulling in 73 of them, just a little over 15, uh, about, uh, so maybe about 11 to 12% because they're in position number three for that. Actually, it's almost 15%. Now, when you're in positions one, two, and three, you'll get anywhere from 10 to 20%. Painters, Dallas, Texas. That's a keyword because it's location specific and service specific. 400 people a month search for it. They're getting 72 of them. That's over, uh, it's almost 20% because they're in position three. 
Same thing for the rest of these. Notice how location and service specific each one of these guys are. So he, and this is the one I put in actually. I put in Dallas Painters for Big House Painting. And he's coming up as number five. So not all of this can be like 100%, I guess, or it hasn't updated yet. But no, wait, I put it in the other way. I put in Painters Dallas. Where is Painters Dallas? Painters Dallas, Texas. He's not getting 10% because he's in position four. So as you can see, as long as you understand how to, what keywords to go for and you get the right ones in there, you should be fine. Um, now, how does this really help you guys out? So number one, we got to get your website up and running because I couldn't find it. So that's number one. Number one, website. Number two, content. Right? We got to divide everything up into what it is you guys actually are offering and doing. We got to get content on those pages. And then lastly, we got to get keywords on those pages as well. We got to make sure people can find you. If people are searching for painting in Dallas, you're the one that comes up. Now, obviously, we got to rank you. How do we do that? We got backlinks. Good news is we go to Big House Painting. We find out the ones they're using. Use the same ones because, again, everyone can use the same ones. And then we add an additional 50 on top of that one so you guys stay on top of the ranking and we can get you. Uh, we beat out the competition. Well, that's really all I got, Roy. Um, those four steps. Um, yes, it's not going to take overnight. If it did, everyone would be doing it. But those four steps in general will help you start getting to the top of the ranking. If you have any questions for me, please feel free to reach out. Other than that, man, you have an amazing day. Bye.